So let's re ever re re ever re 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 rewind for a moment. And y'all just remember what it felt like to work that muscle of imagination. Well, see, at my very first business meeting, and I mean like ever, <laughs> three Care Bears sat across from Teddy Ruxpin while we strategized ways to entice investors, my parents, into supporting my candy business. Now, I just remember that, that feeling, that, that joy of excitement of starting something new, that revving mm -hmm. Mm -hmm of the engine, the hope for success. Well, y'all, it's been years since I sold any piece of candy, but that internal drive to want to do something, well, that remains an itch I must scratch. And I've since learned that there are those who accept the world as is and us, those who take opinions and ideas and turn them into facts. So what does it mean to start fresh? to re ever re re ever re 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 imagine what was in a brand new light. Well, for me, my poetry began as written art. I mean, I remember spending hours sifting through a thesaurus and a dictionary in search of the perfect rhyming word. Y'all, I thought poetry, I mean, all poetry was meant to be read and not heard. So whether I was writing about what love, epiphany, or even rage, the scope of my world was limited. And so my poetry simply existed in libraries and chapbooks, and I left it all on the page. But something changed the day that a friend invited me to an event. It was 8 p.m. on a Tuesday night, and me, lover of the arts, attended an open mic where y'all poetry was read aloud and there was no page. And so for the first time, I witnessed this magnetic power of poets performing live on stage. And y'all at that very moment, I'm not kidding you, I began to re ever re re ever re 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 imagine the path that I took. That night I allowed my poems to leap from the book. And I don't know what came over me, but I signed my name on the open mic list. Y'all, I walked up on that stage and I stood there sweating and afraid. But you know, pushing ourselves out of our comfort zone, well, y'all, that's the only way that we grow. We must believe that our shaking knees will turn to rooted trees amidst the mightiest of wind blow and, and, and take hold of new opportunities with confidence. So that's what I did. I began to re ever re re ever re 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 invent myself as a spoken word artist. Y'all, I went from libraries to coffee shops. And if I attended any open mic, honey, I was going to make that mic drop. Because <laughs> it was blood, sweat, and tears that I was going to give to these years. And I elevated to a level of sold out crowds with cheers. But let me tell y'all something. When your position becomes too familiar. Well, that's a sign. I'm gonna say it again. When your position becomes too familiar, that's a sign. That's a sign that it's time to test yourself. Y'all shake things up a bit. Get a new perspective. Shine a new light, honey. Return to your grit and re ever re re ever re 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 remix it. You know, my dad, my dad says all the time, caress. You got to get you a bag of tricks. And see, that bag is simply filled with new inspirations, almost like a, a new coat that you wear to make people notice and pay attention to whatever it is that you do. So I've always had this crazy attraction to music. And so I found a way to fuse it with my poetry. And what began as two drumsticks became my bag of tricks as I transitioned from beating on tabletops, y'all, to be boxing with my lips, like So the next up, right, I would add this melody. 
Because for me, y'all, music was everywhere. I mean, it was in the air that I breathe. So I began to weave music and art so carefully. And then my art, my, my reach, my evolution became endless. All stemming from my commitment to re-re-re-re-re-imagine. Because see, as long as I can re-re-re-re-re-re-imagine, y'all, possibilities are endless. So I encourage you today to, to, to give yourself permission to create, explore. Because as you re ever re re ever re 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 evaluate what you've been doing, well, re ever re 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 imagine, re ever re 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 remix, re ever re re recreate. In areas where there's no solutions, you can create some because y'all, the work that we do is ongoing. There is no destination, y'all. There's no final hour. So if we rejuvenate and we remain ready and willing, well, y'all, I believe we can change the world with our superpowers. Da-da-da-da. <laughs>